Good afternoon. Greetings. I'm Lene Gray with the CLEF Summer Program. Today's topic will be sight reading rhythms. Well, what do you think that means? That means when you look at that music that you're playing and the rhythmic pulse or the rhythmic flow or the meter, you're looking at it, you're playing it, and the question comes up when you see something very strange. Oh, I don't know how to do this. How do you clap this rhythm? How do I play this rhythm? Rule number one, the things that are available to you in a score, a musical piece of music, is that fraction thing that's a time signature and those shape notes, whether they be on the staff or outside of the staff, but particularly because you're looking at music, you're going to be looking at shape notes. And by shape notes, we're talking about the note values, a quarter notes, a half notes, a dotted half notes, and so forth and so on. It is very easy to do them, whether to clap them and play them when they fall on the beat. But what happens as always, when you see these intricate rhythms and you're zoning out and you look and say, oh my gosh, what do I do with this? Look at your time signature. If it's in what we call simple meter or 4-4 four, four time signature, where the four is at the bottom and your quarter note is the main beat, this is going to be your heartbeat. This is where everything occurs. And it's like our body. Our heart is constant. So no matter what happens, if I were to do a, a reading pattern that had a quarter note, some eighth notes, uh, 16th notes, it would sound like this. And I'm going to do it on the pulse. Ba, 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 ba. Those are the easy ones to read. But what happens when within this main pulse, we start getting these pulses off the, on the end of something and you look at it and you just don't know what to do. Always remember your pulse. So if I go from a rhythmic sequence, it sounds like this. Ba, what was constant was the fact that you had that heartbeat going on. It is that heartbeat, that continuous pulse, the thing that causes you to pat your foot on that beat. What is the beat? What is the beat? No matter what the numerical division or grouping of those notes are, you still have that heartbeat. Lock it in. Ba, ba, mm, ba, mm, ba, ba. One, two, three, four. Mm, ba, 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 ba. So the key to good sight reading and rhythms, not to worry, not to be anxious. Remember where the pulse is. What is your main pulse? They just fit into place. They know where to live. Look at your score. And it is important if you don't have someone that can say, well, it sounds like this. Everything, this is where math and music link together. It always is constant. You can always find where the and is. You can always find where every part of the beat is. If you've got quarter notes, da, 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 da. Half notes, da, da. Eighth notes, da, 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 da. If you have the 16th notes, eighth note triplets, dotted quarter eighth, da, 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 da. And if I wanted to do eighth to sixteenth patterns, those are an eighth note with two sixteenth notes, da, 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 da. Da, 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 da. If I wanted to do an eighth rest with an eighth note, da, 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 da. It is that heartbeat that is a saving salvation for all that we do in music. Sight reading rhythms. Don't panic. Keep 
your pulse. Keep your heartbeat going. You can do this.